Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching, subscribing to the channel. In today's video, guys, we'll be working here on a Mazda vehicle, guys. And if you have a Mazda, okay, and you have a rattle noise coming from the engine, guys, when you start the car on cold engine, or you have that rattle noise all the time, guys, we'll explain what could cause that. And it's something very, very bad, guys. Something that if you fix on time, you can prevent getting a new engine, pretty much. Because if you don't fix it on time, you can say bye-bye to your engine. So, stay with us guys, we'll discuss what that is, we'll show you in detail as well. In addition, we'll have more than 200 videos on every vehicle we get at the shop, guys. Our mission is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel, okay, like the video and drop a comment below, guys, and let us know if the video was helpful. So, let's start on it now. So, you can see, guys, we took the engine completely apart. Now, this is the valve cover, timing cover out of the way, this is the engine, that's what it looks like, check it out. And this is a timing chain driven engine guys, timing chain engine. Now Mazda on their newer vehicles, almost all of them will be timing chain engines guys. And what is causing that rattle guys? Okay, stay with us, we'll explain the reasons towards the end, but that rattle is caused by a timing chain, loose timing chain. And that timing chain guys, when it gets loose, okay, that timing chain is going to hit guys the valve cover or the guides inside the engine. Okay, check out the valve cover now. You can see these spots right here. You can see where the chain was going through. Okay, this was loose chain, guys. And when the chain stretches, okay, it's going to touch the valve cover and it will cause that rattle noise, metal noise, which is terrible. Uh, at first, okay, you're probably thinking, should I go more or not? But you should, guys, definitely stop your car at a safe place and get it fixed. Okay, be, because every start can cause your timing chain to jump and as a result ruin your engine and end up uh, getting a new engine. So, let us show you guys what causes that. It could be a few things. The most common one is a bad timing chain tensioner, guys. Okay, so this is the timing chain with the sprockets here, camshafts, intake, exhaust camshaft. Okay, and towards right here, this is your timing chain tensioner guys this is the tensioner that puts tension on the chain and it should keep it tight all the time now this is a hydraulic tensioner which means that it's uh, uh, controlled by the oil pressure and this tensioner fails in two ways if the tooth guys and loses an oil pressure okay uh, is bad okay if it starts leaking oil out of it what will happen the chain will get uh, loose especially in the, at you know when you're starting the car on a cold start let's say you didn't start the car for a few hours then you start it and you hear that rattle noise could be caused because of that if it does it all the time okay it either the tensioner fail okay let us show you now it has very small oil canals okay oil holes where the oil goes through and if they get plugged up from not regular oil changes on from, from carbon build up in the engine check it out guys it's extremely low what will cause that? Okay, uh, the tensioner not to build enough pressure and will not be able to keep tension on the chain. As a result, guys, the chain will be loose and you will start, okay, having slack. That slack will hit the timing, uh, the valve cover, excuse me. And if you develop too much of a slack, you will jump the timing, you will bend valves, hit the pistons, and you're done, guys. You either need uh, major work on your engine and thousands of dollars okay or you need to get a new engine which is pretty much the same thing so now guys that could be also caused by a stretch chain the chain that's too old stretched and wore out sprockets as well so if you do that get the whole kit guys we'll have everything listed in the description of the video below to see where we get our replacement parts all that will be there so hopefully guys the video will be helpful please guys hit that subscribe button for more videos and see you guys next time